In this tutorial, we will learn how to create a lexicon. With a lexicon, you can create shortcuts so you can take notes more efficiently. For example, shortcuts appear under the subjective field of our SOPI chart when I click here. Now, let's go to the lexicon tab in the charting section of the account. Here you will find pre-made customizable lexicons to help you start. For example, this is a customizable osteopathy lexicon. You can create your own lexicon by clicking on the Add button on the top left. Let's start by giving it a name like osteopathy. You can also optionally add a description like lexicon for osteopaths DO for example. Let's take a look at the boxes predictive writing and shortcuts. In the box predictive writing, you can add shortcuts for symbols and groups of words used frequently in your charting. This is very useful if you use a tablet because you can add symbols that may be hard to find without a computer keyboard. Here we create shortcuts for the arrows indicating an increase or a decrease as well as the letters R and L in uppercase to indicate right and left. Please note that each item must be added to a new line. Let's see how you can add a shortcut to a group of words. We'll start with the name of the group. For this example, let's name it support, followed by a colon. The words you add after the colon, like unipodal support and bipodal support, are included in the group. Note that the terms added to the group must be separated by commas. The order of the shortcuts display will be determined by the order of the items entered in the box. For example, since the group support is on the sixth line of this section, it will be associated with shortcut number 6 in the client's file. You could also use the keyboard shortcut ALT6 to have access to this group of words. Now, if I fill out a chart template associated with this lexicon, I can go to Support by clicking ALT6, and then if I click ALT1, I can add unipodal support. I invite you to watch our tutorial, How to Use a Lexicon, to learn more. Let's return to our lexicon and click on shortcuts. Here you can associate acronyms with certain words to quickly add them to your notes. This is useful to add terms that are often used without having to write them out each time. When you want to add an acronym to your shortcuts, be aware that uppercase letters are taken into account. For example, the lowercase letters P, R, G, T here are a shortcut for pregnant but the word won't be offered by the lexicon if you write it in uppercase. It is possible to share your lexicon with the community of professionals using Go Rendezvous. You also have access to the communal library to adapt and use lexicons created by other users. Thank you for watching our video on lexicon creation. We wish you a beautiful day.